Okay, this one is Bill, Joe, each put 10 into their separate accounts. So Bill earns an interest at a constant annual effect rate of K over 25. And Joe earns at a force of interest of um, one over K plus. Point now says at the end of four years, each account is X fun X. Okay, so let's cross out 10. Uh, let's convert this into a logarithm. So we could get rid of E. So four uh, log one plus K over 25. And then let's just bring this whole thing that down by putting a logarithm. Another thing that we could do is we can set U equal to K plus Point two five t in du as point two five times dt, and then you could put one over point twenty five outside of there, and then change it to one over u. And then this could be simplified to four. So then the whole answer would be uh, four ln k plus 0.25t. Now you could just plug in four and zero. So first power is ln k plus one. Now the second part when you plug in is just L and K, right? Now we can convert this to a fraction, right? The quotient rule, so K plus one over K. Uh, L and right? Now, what we have left here is ln 1 plus k25. So based on law of logarithms, when we see a case like this, we just get rid of the lns and make them equal to each other to find k. So I'm going to simplify this k out to become 0.04k. And... Then put K over to the other side. And then I can get K plus 0 0.04 K squared and equals K plus one. So get rid of K, get in one, right? And then you're gonna do, 1 over 0 0.04 is 25. And then we'll find out that k equals 5. Now, it says that we have to find x. So we could plug in 5 in either equation. So this seems to be the easier equation. So let's do 5 divided by 25.2 plus 1 to the 4 times 10. And we end up getting 20.73, which is close to day.